I'm Stacy Zinn Roberts, and I'm the host of Live Your Passion. Welcome to 2014. Well, what do you think? Is it going to be a good year? I think it's going to be a fantastic year. I really do. But I have a little bit of a trick up my sleeve that I want to share with you that might help you to feel that way, too. I've created a strategic plan for 2014. Have you done that for yourself? Have you ever done that for yourself? Created a written plan for the year? It's really a useful tool because um, it gives you kind of a guidepost as you go along. So let's say that you have a major goal. Let's say this year you want to do something like go back to school, but you really don't know where to start. That's a, that's a pretty lofty goal, don't you think? That's a big thing. How do you do it? Well, you break it down into smaller pieces. Maybe you can work towards that a little bit today. Maybe there's something you can do in a week's time. Maybe there's something you can do in the next month that helps you get towards your goal. Maybe there's something you can do in three months, then in six months. If you break it down in smaller pieces, it's easier. Let me give an example. So if, if you do want to go back to school, let's say today you can uh, do a Google search on the types of schools that offer the education that you're looking for that might be in your general area. Okay, you can do that today. That's not too hard. So you create this Google search and you, and you do a list. Maybe you do that today. Or maybe that takes a week. Let's say it takes you a week to really do a thorough Google search on the internet as to the schools in your area that offer the type of education you want. Then in the next month, perhaps you go through that list and decide there are three schools you're interested in learning more about. And you visit them. So you pay a visit to three schools campuses within the next month. I can do that. That's not too hard. In three months' time, after you have visited those schools and decided which one or two you are interested in, perhaps you gather all of their uh, curricula information and you fill out an application. You can do that in three months. That's not too hard, right? So you do that. You fill out an application. In six months, well, perhaps you look at the uh, ways that you would fund that school. Do you need to get a part-time job? Can you get loans? Can you get, um, um, <laughs> I've, I've lost the word, not loans, but the other thing that's free, <laughs> grants. <laughs> Is that possible? Is that open to you? You meet with a, uh, a financial aid counselor within the six-month period of time. You do all that work, and by the end of the year, guess what? You could be a college student. But it's, it, you did it by breaking it down into smaller pieces. Doesn't that make sense? And you can do that in pretty much every area of your life. So when I created my strategic plan for 2014, it included a lot of different things. All of the different goals I have for myself and for What's Your Avocado over the next year. Including my forthcoming book, How to Live Your Passion and Fulfill Your Dreams, will be out the first quarter. And that's part of my strategic plan. I'm in final writing of the book and editing, and it will be published by the end of the first quarter. That is my goal, and that's in the plan. And you can read more about strategic planning in the book, How to Live Your Passion and Fulfill Your Dreams. So, it's all good, and I think 2014 is going to be just, just really fabulous. There's a world of possibilities open. I hope you feel it, too. Create a plan, because if you don't know where you're going, how do you know when you get there? I'm Stacy Zing Roberts. And this has been Live Your Passion. Happy New Year. Bye.